So we tight the bananas, okay? If you see no holes are uh, being covered. Now, and then we put all the roof poles on the outside. And sometimes if you have your platform very, very high, you can also put these roof poles on the inside of the yurt, right? Um, it really doesn't matter. What, what you want to do is just for it to be easily reached. So you can also put it inside here like this. Okay. So I'm gonna walk away a little bit so you can see. There, it's also like that. I understand that some platforms are higher that you cannot reach and you'll find difficulties. Therefore, you can put the yurt up from inside the yurt. <clears throat> and then when you are unpacking your roof poles, you might find some odd pieces which has got pins. If you see here, this is marked D1, yeah, D number two, door number two, and then for door number three. And then if you see above your door frame, I'm not very tall enough, but if you see above your door frame, there would be some markings in here. Yeah, it would correspond to, see, can you see that? Right. Same in here, we have windows. <clears throat> yeah, so this is for that. Right, now we're going to raise the crown up after this. <clears throat> 